Nigeria exports more oil than any other African country. It's also in the middle of a fuel crisis. How is that even possible? It's because Nigeria lacks enough refineries, the crucial step between the crude oil that's pumped out of the ground and the fuel that goes in your gas tank. You have an oil producer that is importing refined products. Unfortunately. It's yeah. insane to think that. It is, it is insane. Nigeria produces between 2.2 and 2.5 million barrels of crude per day, yet it's not able to process more than about 100,000 barrels per day. But right outside Lagos, there's a solution under construction. Africa's richest man is building one of the largest oil refineries in the world. This is one single largest refinery line in the world, which is 650,000 barrels a day. Getting to 650,000 barrels of refined fuel won't be easy. It takes a whole complex covering almost 10 square miles. How is this going to change the playing field in Nigeria? Well, it is going to change it a great deal. This one we're building will satisfy 100% the needs of Nigeria. If we meet domestic requirement, domestic uh, demand, we will still have surplus to export. So that we become what we, Nigeria, should be the hub of petroleum products uh, uh, supply in the region. Dangote Group also wants to tap another underused resource, Nigerian workers. We are going to have our own direct employees probably between 2,000 and 4,000. Employing thousands and solving a country's fuel crisis won't be cheap, but it will be profitable. How much is this project costing? Altogether, we will be able to manage it within less than $12 billion. Probably we'll be able to get our investment back within seven years. For now, these grand plans still look like this. The refinery won't be completed until the end of 2018, and that means more waiting for Nigerians. Eleni Jarkos, CNN, Lagos.